Hello everyone and welcome to another video. Now in today's video, I am going to be showing you how to use the cruise control and the infotainment system on the Toyota CHR Hybrid. So the Toyota CHR Hybrid comes with a standard cruise control system and the control stick is mounted on the right side of the steering wheel. It's at the bottom side a little bit and in order to start using it there is an on off button so when you press that button on the screen you can see that there is a notification that pops up in the green color which says it's activated now to set the speed you have to flick this stick down at the desired speed and then the cruise control will resume and start functioning and in order to increase or decrease the speed you have to flick this stick up or down in order to you know increase the speed you have to press in the plus direction upwards and in order to decrease the speed you have to flick it down and to cancel the uh, cruise control system you have to just flick it in the forward direction pull it towards you and it will be cancelled or also you can press the brake and you know cancel the system but in order to resume the adapt the sorry the cruise control from where you left it you can just flick it upwards in the resume uh, where R E R E S is written in that direction and you can start using the cruise control again so that is just how you activate and deactivate the cruise control and in order to switch the cruise control off press this uh, button and then you can see on the screen the notification goes off well the infotainment screen is a 7 inch tft touch screen and it's pretty easy to use actually so all the menu options are laid out on both the sides so you have the home menu audio info and also the channel the track phone and apps and everything and these are the volume control and the scroll to you know change the or go through the menu so in order to first start using this is your home screen these are the widgets so this is the sound so you can see i've already clicked on it and this is your performance so it shows you uh you know uh, when is the electric motor battery and charge and everything and all the information about your trip that you can access from here how much you are doing in terms of efficiency and everything so you can go through that menu and see everything and this is the time that you can change if you want to do any changes to that menu and then the, this is the phone whenever it is connected it would show you options out here so these are like the shortcut uh, widgets that you can access and then when you swipe you have more access to the different this is the menu option so you can either press the menu button or you can just swipe it and then access the audio where you can change uh, you know the source the AM, FM, DAB, Bluetooth and the mirror cast and in order to go back you just press the menu button again and then there is phone whenever you are connected it will show you all the phone options again and then this is the app option so whenever I connect my phone using the the bluetooth or the usb then it will show me all the apps out here and also there is information where it will show me again about my trip and everything also you can go to history and check like a detail sort of you know history check if you want to there's also energy which will tell you again to that same screen which will show you how much is your battery power and how much is your engine and everything and in order to go back again to the menu then we have a detailed setup of uh, you know different things where you want to change the clock the language the theme the settings you can change everything the units of measurement so i can have kilometers per liter so i can do that and then it will show me on my screen let me show you um, it should be showing me now yes see so that's the kilometers per liter that has been changed on my center uh, dashboard screen and also different animations and everything there's also bluetooth connections so you can change you know the bluetooth uh, connections you can add or remove device you can add the registered device everything you can do from here there's also audio so you can change the common settings for that you can also change the settings for your fm your dab your phone you can add or remove your phone from here there is a remove button and then there is again sorry there is voice commands you can change the voice commands however you want there is also vehicle settings so vehicle customization where you can change the 
door lock settings and the light settings inside so the daytime running lights and also the light sensor sensitivity so when you want the auto headlights you know start or, or switch on or off you can change that from here there are interior lights also on off timer for that also then there is let me go back and then there is wi-fi so you can connect the wi-fi and sort of create a local hotspot out here inside the car so that everyone can use it then there is the smart uh, device link which is your usb connected application so like your apple carplay and the android auto so this system is just very very simple to use pretty much you can access all the options from here also let me show you like this you know when you press the button there's also information again you can go so there are multiple ways with which you can you know access the the menus out here so you can also go to the apps again which i showed you before the smart device link app so there are lots of ways you can access this menu and it's a very easy to use menu also so that is it for this video give it a thumbs up if this video was helpful in understanding the cruise control and the infotainment system in the toyota chr hybrid now if you want to subscribe to my channel then you can click here and if you want to watch more videos then click here i shall see you in the next video bye bye and take care